I'm Brie McKee and here's the news you need to know in 90 seconds. Number one, this week we celebrate National Agriculture and National Mining and Related Industries Day to acknowledge the contribution of Australia's most productive industries. Our agriculture and mining sectors generate the jobs, export revenue and national wealth that we all share in. Our leaders must back industries that fuel growth and pay for services. Number two, the cost of living crisis is hitting home, but older Australians are splashing out. New spending data shows Australians under 30 are cutting back on essentials as prices rise, while older Australians splurge on cruises and dining out. With inflation out of control, how many more interest rates will the RBA have to make? Number three, Labor's electric dreams have hit a roadblock as EV sales spiral. Predictions show less than a third of new car sales will be battery operated by 2030, pulling the plug on Labor's green agenda modelling. With the cost of living crisis taking hold, who can really afford a pricey new electric vehicle? Number four, the socialist experiment in Argentina has ended with the election of libertarian president Javier Malay. Once one of the world's richest countries, Argentina now has a poverty rate of 40% and inflation running at over 100%. The new leader has promised to cut spending and reform the economy. He has his work cut out for him. That's it for this week. To become a Generation Liberty member or to learn more about Generation Liberty's work to advance freedom on university campuses, visit generationliberty.org.au.